So Daniel asks the question, what do you do when things get quiet as a production company? Whenever you're in business, uh, you get busy times and you also get the quiet times. It, it tends to be called the feast or famine cycle and it's a cycle that ideally we would love to avoid. In an ideal world, what I would love is I'd love Avida to be a nice level of busy all year round. But the reality of it is that things go absolutely crazy and then everything goes quiet. But those quiet times are the times that end up being freaky and scary. I know for me, when things get quiet, I still have to pay wages, I still have to pay office bills, I still have all of my monthly fees, and it's freaking scary because I don't know when the quiet time is going to end. My advice definitely is do not waste that quiet time just sitting idly waiting for business to come in. You have to work out what contacts you already have that may be open to doing something new and, and having some more business. Uh, but also, look at ways of improving your business itself. Uh, we use the downtime to look at our marketing material. We may look at our brand. We, we may start to create other collateral that we might need for pitching. So that when things get busy again, business is easier and it's also a lot more fluid. The other thing we're able to do is we're able to innovate. Now you see I'm standing next to this very unusual looking camera, the Nokia Ozo. So before, uh, Vivida mostly focused on visual storytelling using video and visual storytelling using photography. And I started to have a think about 360 video. So this camera shoots 360 and I used the downtime in order to make sure or to start to research 360 video. So what we did, downtime, research, then we started to understand the equipment and then we ended up using that downtime to create an example video. And then we went out and we showed our new creation to our existing clients and guess what happened? We booked 360 video and in fact we're on location now and that's actors behind me doing a 360 video London, sirens. We did a 360 video today that was purely because we used the downtime to innovate, to come up with new ideas and new angles for our business. And as a result, we now have gone back into feast. And we're praying that it doesn't go back to famine. And if it does, we'll be ready to make the most of that time. Please, uh, Feel free to subscribe. Thank you very much to those of you who already joined me on YouTube. And also, if you would, uh, leave a comment in the comments below. We love reading those. And if you have an idea or something you'd like me to talk about on the Simi Inquiry YouTube channel, uh, you know how to do it.